Hey, I'm Coach Kozak from Hasfit, and this is my lower back stretching routine. It's a great exercise routine to relieve pain and stiffness in your lower back. I'm going to do the whole routine with you, and if you're ready to feel better, let's get started. Okay, we're going to do this routine on the floor. The first one we're going to do is a camel to a cat. So we're going to get on our knees and on our hands. And first, we're going to break our lower back, pressing your butt up. And we're going to hold there for 15 seconds, pushing your stomach to the floor. And three, two, one. Then we're going to go press your upper back up, go into the camel, holding this one for 15 seconds, stretching up. Back. I want you to pretend like somebody's pulling you up with a string in the middle of your back. And then back to the cat. Arching your lower back, stretching down. Nice, big, deep, full breaths while you do this. And last one, back up to the camel. Breathe. And good. Now, we're going to go to a prone position, and there's two versions of this one. So on our forearms, the easier version is to stretch here, and if you're feeling a little more flexible, you can get up on your hands and stretch here. So I'm going to let you choose which one is right for you. I recommend you start with this one, and if this one feels okay, then you can progress to here. Keeping your head up the whole time. 10 more seconds. Good. Breathe. Nice, big, deep, full breaths. And break. Now, lying down flat. One leg at a time. We're going to do prone leg raises. Holding one leg up. Keep your legs straight. We're doing 15 seconds per leg. Hold up and breathe. Good, keep that leg up. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, and switch. Opposite leg up. Keeping that leg straight. Raising with your butt muscles and just hold. And five, four, three, two, one. Good. I'm going to turn over next. Lying on your back. Feet are up, hands to your side. Now we're going to thrust your pelvic down into the ground. So now I'm pressing my pelvic down into the ground and I'm squeezing and I'm holding. Hard to pick up on the camera, but I'm squeezing down right here as I'm trying to push my pelvic through the floor and just hold an isometric contraction. Good, breathe. Keep squeezing, keep pressing your butt through the floor. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Relax. Take a big deep breath. Now we're going to do a hip up, pressing off your heels, and squeeze your butt up at the top. So we're lifting up with our glutes. Hold, pressing off your heels. Good. We're holding this one for 30 seconds total. Breathe. Good, good. Ten more seconds. Keep breathing. Three, two, one. Okay, down and relax. Next one, we're going to do a line knee twist. I want you to put your arms out to your side, bring your knees up, 90 degree angle. And we're going to, while keeping your back flat, we're going to twist to a 45 degree angle and hold. If you're really flexible, you can go a little farther, but for most people, a 45 degree angle is going to be just right. And hold. We're going to do both sides. And again, don't forget to breathe. Very important. And switch. 
to the other side and hold. And notice how I'm keeping my back flat. I'm not rolling up. Good, keep holding. A few more seconds. And five, four, three, two, one. Okay, good, relax. Next, we're gonna do a line knee to your chest. I want you to bring your knees in and pull them into your chest as far as you can. Now I'm pretty flexible so I can get them all the way here. I want you to keep your butt on the ground, or I'm sorry, your, your hips on the ground. Don't roll up. While keeping your hips on the ground, bring your knees all the way into your chest. If you can only get them this far, that's okay. Bring them in as far as you can while still remaining comfortable. And hold. Good, breathe. Now this routine is great to stretch out your lower back, but if you're experiencing ongoing pain, it's very important that you have lower back strength as well. So make sure you check out one of Hasfit's lower back strength exercise routines to build strength in your lower back too. This is just a stretching routine. Okay, good. Now let your legs come out. Now we're going to alternate one leg at a time, pulling one knee in at a time to your chest. Keep a one leg flat, keep this one flat, don't let it come up. While keeping your opposite leg flat, pull one knee up. We're going to hold for 15 seconds. Good. And five, four, three, two, one. Okay, switch it up. And bring this one up. Again, keep an opposite leg flat and holding for 15 seconds. Big deep breaths. And just a few more seconds. Three, two, one. Okay. Now we're going to do one leg raise at a time. Hands it to your side. Keep your legs straight and bring one leg up. If you can't quite get it as high as I can, that's okay. Do your best and just bring it up as high as you can while keeping it straight. I'd rather you keep it straight than get it all the way up and have your knee bent. So keep it straight, bring it up. You're gonna feel a big stretch all down your leg. And a lot of lower back stiffness comes from having stiff hamstrings. So this is gonna help you out on a couple different levels. Few more seconds and switch. Good again, keeping that leg straight, and then the one on the floor is straight as well. I'll let this one come up. Good. Five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Good. Okay. Now we're going to bring one knee up and we're going to let it drop to the side. So this side angle of this one, one knee up and we're going to let it drop to the side. Good. We're going to hold here. I want you to go to just where you start to feel the stretch. I don't want it to get to the point where it feels super uncomfortable. Holding this one for 15 seconds total. And three, two, one. And opposite side. Good, and slowly moving into the stretch position. Good, breathe. And five, four, three, two, one. Reverse it. All right, so we're all done with the routine. Hey everybody, Coach Kozak here from Hasfit for my lower back strengthening workout. This is a great workout that you can do at home that doesn't require any equipment whatsoever, except for maybe a mat because we are gonna do some floor exercises. If you're experiencing lower back pain, 
I recommend that you combine this strengthening workout with the Hasfit lower back stretching workout. The combination of strengthening and gaining flexibility in your lower back often helps to relieve that lower back pain. All right, if you're ready to go, I am too. Let's get this started. Okay, we're gonna start on the ground with the Superman. We're gonna lie down on our stomachs in a prone position with our arms out in front of us. And at the same time, you're gonna bring your arms up off the ground and your legs up off the ground and contract your lower back. That's one, two, we're doing 12 all together, three, and don't swing and use momentum to do it, but nice and controlled, four, Five. Don't forget to breathe. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, two more, eleven, and twelve. Good. Next, we're going to do an alternating Superman. So that means we're going to lift up your right arm and your left leg at the same time, and then your left arm and your right leg at the same time. Okay, 12 more, six on each. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, still breathing, nine, ten, eleven, one more, and twelve. Good. Next, we're going to stand up. We're going to do a body weight good morning. I didn't make the name up to this one. We're going to put your hands on your ears, feet a little bit wider than shoulder width, a little bend in your knee, and we're going to bend over at your waist, keeping your back straight, feeling a stretch in your back side, and then butt forward. And I don't want you to be slouched over on this one. Keep your shoulders retracted, butt back, but four, that's two. Again, we're doing 12. Three, good. It helps you keep your eyes up, helps keep your back straight. But back, but four, four, five. Feel that stretch. Six is a great one for your whole posterior chain. Seven, good. Eight, keep those shoulders retracted. Nine, ten, two more, eleven, last one, twelve, good, okay, we're going back down to the ground next, lying on our backs, with our feet firmly planted on the ground, hands are at our side, next we're going to do a hip up, we're going to press up off your heels and squeeze your butt up at the top. One, two, again, 12 times, three, four, squeezing that butt, not arching your back, five, six, seven, You're doing great, keep it up, eight, nine, ten, two more, eleven, and last one. 12, good. All right, flipping around now into a high plank position. So depending on your fitness level, we're either gonna do this one from our knees right here or up on our feet. So you'll be the one, you'll get to decide which one is right for you. Um, if we're on our knees, I'm gonna demonstrate the form for you. Keeping that knee bent, we're just gonna Lift your legs straight up and alternate. And on this one, you want to make sure you get to the point where your leg is parallel with your body and not kicking way up where all of a sudden your lower back is forced to torque and tweak and all that terrible nonsense. So there's an easier version and then the harder version up on a high plank position, keeping your legs straight again is here and raising your leg up again until it's parallel with your body. So you decide 
which one is right for you. Okay, I'm gonna do the easy one this first round, but we're doing 12 alternating legs. Okay, ready, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, that's halfway, eight, nine, 10, squeezing your butt up at the top, 11, and last one, 12, good. That's the end of the first round. Okay, one more round, going back to the Supermans, lying back in that prone position, flat on our stomachs. Arms are out, and again, it's nice and controlled movement, we're not Flinging our arms and legs up at the same time. Okay, control. One, two, good. Three, four, three, five, six, seven, five more. Eight, nine, ten, only two more. 11, and last one, 12, good job. Okay, now we're going into the alternating supermans, remember? Right arm, left leg to start. Ready, and go. One, two, three. Again, same thing, under control. Four, five, six, seven, more than halfway done, eight, Nine, ten, two more, eleven, and twelve. Good. Next, we're getting up on our feet for those good mornings. Hands are on our head, a little bit of the knee, feet a little wider than shoulder width. Start with that, starting with a little bend in your knee, and then that's the whole bend. There's no more flexion in the knee after this. Butt back, keeping your head up. And stretch, one, two, get that back straight. If you can't quite go as far down as I can, that's totally okay. Four, five, just get as far down as you can comfortably. Six, and then as you do this and as your flexibility increases, seven, you'll be able to go down a little further. Eight, but no matter what, don't take your upper body past parallel to the ground. Nine. And two more. Eleven. And last one. Twelve. Good. Going back to the ground for the hip ups. Hands are at your side. Feet are close to your butt. And you're lifting your butt up off the ground, pressing off your heels. Ready? And one. Two. Three, four, good, five, again, not squeezing your back, six, but contracting your glutes, seven, and your butt, eight, all the way down in between every time, nine, and all the way up, ten, two more, eleven, and twelve, good. All right, flip it over for the last one. We're doing the plank leg raises. And as you remember last time, I did the, the easier version here. This time I'm gonna do the harder version. Okay, keeping those legs straight. Count with me now, last 12. Ready, one, two, three, four. Keep that back straight, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and last one, twelve. Excellent work. I hope you enjoyed this lower back strengthening workout. Do this two to three times per week over the next month or so. 
and you'll definitely see an improvement in your core strength and your lower back strength. Make sure you check out Hasbit's website for hundreds of additional free workouts, our free meal plans to help lose or gain weight, complete fitness programs from 30 to 90 days. Also, please do me a favor and subscribe to this YouTube channel so we can help keep this great service free. Like us on our Facebook fan page for the best daily motivation. And if you feel inspired to do so, pick up a t-shirt or a poster, anything to give you that edge, keep you motivated, working towards that goal. I'm Coach Kozak from Hasfit, and I'll see you at your next workout.